everyone. Welcome. Olga is here and welcome to the five day tapping forgiveness challenge. I'm so excited about this particular event. We ran a similar one in spring 2017 and it was very sporadic. It was just something that I needed to do for myself to forgive my ex-husband and hundreds of women joined me. So I'm so excited to, to do this again officially and to join even more people who are on a path to go within and change themselves because when you do this, everything else transforms. So we are on day one and today we are diving into your big why. So in each of the challenges, in each of the day of the challenges, there's three things that I'll ask you to do. I'll ask you to learn something and today is going to be why is it important to have the why and how it will affect the process of forgiving, what benefits are truly really are be behind letting go and forgiving someone or yourself. And the second thing I'll ask you to do is ask you to do something and it's going to be tapping for most of the cases. So stay till the end of the video so we can tap on this together because that's where the change is really happening. And finally, I'll ask you to share. And this is where the magic happens. When you start talking out loud and sharing your results and inspiring others, you create amazing ripple effect. And things that you work in it, they are multiply and really amplify your results. So I'll ask you to share in the Emotional Reason and Entrepreneur group. It's a very safe and gorgeous community. Uh, it's a closed group, so uh, <coughs> things are kind of private and personal. It's totally fine. We are all on the same journey here, so it's, it's nice to be uh, surrounded by like-minded people. So let's go ahead and start. And my question for you today, of course, is what is your big why? Why are you doing this gorgeous work? And of course, I talked so many times about how is it forgiveness making such a huge difference and why is it so important to actually go and, and address those past hurts? Because the truth is our internal representations, which is, you know, for other people, that's what help us create anything and everything in our lives. So people will say, well, that's in the past story. And so we'll think about that person. Do you feel emotional? intensity and if you feel hurt or guilt or or betrayal or anything else guess what it's you doing this to you right it's not them anymore and this is exactly why forgiveness work is so profound and makes such a huge difference in people's life on so many levels because it really puts you back in the driver's seat and i Unless you do this work and you really go inside and you let go of that, you are blaming others for your current present situation, for your current circumstances. So think about it, guys. Who are you holding responsible for where you are in your life right now? And I've done a lot of work, but believe me, I can think of a person or two that, that I could join you on this journey and go deeper and, and release some of that. So We'll be doing it right alongside with you. But I do want to share some results that I had when I went inside and I've done some of this gorgeous emotional cleansing. I literally lost 30 pounds in 2017. And I'm, I'm going to lose another 30 or 40 by the end of the year because because it's it's just shedding off my body. It's the emotional weight and physical weight that really represent the same thing. <coughs> um my monthly income for May 2017 was close to $30,000. Now, it's not every month like that, but I really did have a very high month after doing work literally in April. Um, I'm, I'm dating an, an, an incredible man who is in my life right now, and, and things are just really improving drastically. And I think it has to do directly with the things that I've addressed within me and how I'm, I'm dealing with some of the current triggers. And here's the truth, guys. Literally yesterday something happened that, that created fearful response and that created quite a bit of apprehension and anxiety. But the emotional resilience that I built up to this moment, it allowed me to feel the feelings and release versus creating a story, get more fearful, and, and create a lot of procrastinations and doubts and other good stuff that will hold us back, right? So, so join me on this journey to learn these skills, to practice them every day for the next five days. And today, the only thing that I want you to do is to, number one, set an intention that you are willing and interested and ready to go back and release and let go. Because a lot of people, people, a lot of times people will say, well, <coughs> really forgive that jerk? Are you crazy? And I said, you know what? That's totally fine, Han. The church is yours. But the truth is, it's you doing this to you, right? It's not them anymore. They probably just moved on with their life. They don't even remember what happened. Or maybe they do and it doesn't matter. It's irrelevant. 
forgiveness is for you. Forgiveness sets you free and it gives you permission to relate to world differently and receive differently. And this is one of the reasons why it's such a great tool for releasing money blocks and increasing abundance in your life. And one of my favorite money coaches, Denise Duffel Thomas, she happened to mention that if she would keep one tool, one tool till the rest of the life, that would be forgiveness. She would let go of everything else. She would just learn how to forgive and let go and just be very, very conscious with this process. And the truth is you will be doing this, right? All your life. You'll go through the layers and you and you forgive. And your life will continually improve. <laughs> uh, there's this gorgeous quote, it's, it's grow or die, right? Essentially, that's that's what our life journeys are. So I want to invite you to, to grow with us and to decide on your big why. So my big why is that I, I want to become a self-made millionaire by the end of 45. And I know there's a lot of alignment and internal work that I need to do to get there. I don't have any millionaires in my family. I'll be the first one. And I want to create wealth in a way that makes different in this world and, and makes this world a better place. And <clears throat> my otherwise, I want to create authentic, deep relationships with uh, with a partner, with a romantic partner, and, and to have this, this person in my life to where we connect and the two of us together is like one plus one equal to a hundred kind of thing. So you can tell I'm a former math teacher, lots of numbers, right, in my life. <laughs> but decide what why is it important to you, whether it's improving your health, because your health is so connected to emotions that you hold within. So releasing resentment and releasing anger does improve your physical body on so many levels. I have a person in my life who started doing some work and all of a sudden he does not need to take his cholesterol, his blood sugar, or his diabetes medications. And of course, there were some changes in diet too. But in combination, it really does work magic. So what is your big why? I'm very curious. Do share um, in the Emotional Resilient Group. I will be posting that video there so you can go ahead and, and, and share and tell us what it is. You can also hashtag um, Forgiveness Challenge Day 1 and just share underneath what is your big why. We are inspired by you. We'll learn from you. So, so come join us and um, let's have fun with this. Let's go ahead and do a quick round of tapping, of allowing ourselves to set intention and allowing ourselves to go a little bit deeper and, and free ourselves essentially, right, from this past hurts and um, pains that, that really does not serve us any longer. They, they played the role in the past, right? And it's okay to let it go. So as you do this, just kind of close your eyes. We'll do the tapping exercise. If you're not familiar with tapping, no worries, totally. It's very, very simple. It's an acupressure technique that helps you change how you feel in your body. So logically, people will say, well, I'm, I'm not upset with them. But emotionally, we're not quite aligned. So the tapping technique really helps you get what you're thinking with what you're feeling so you are congruent with what's going on in your life. And you can manifest from the place to not where you say one thing and you do the other and you think the third one, right? And you feel the fourth one. But you really are vibrating on the level to where you're ready to receive things that you desire. So as you close your eyes, think about the person that you're forgiving and think about yourself. And we'll just do a quick round on setting the intention. As you do so, just tap between your eyes and say, today I choose to embark on this journey to set myself free from the old pain. All the things that happened still happens that create this emotional turbulence. I give myself permission to see it differently, to go within and to release. It truly really does not have to be complicated. More has to do with how I feel about myself. And it's my time to love myself differently, to treat myself better. Because that's what forgiveness is. It's not about them. It's me giving something to me. Forgive literally means to give. So it's my time to learn how to receive. To learn how to surrender, to set an intention, that it's safe for me to let it go. 
it's safe for me to do things differently, to feel lighter, more present, release heaviness, give myself permission to move on, change perspective. It's safe for me to forgive others and it's safe for me to forgive myself. And I'm so excited for this five days ahead to really dive in into the forgiveness process so my life can improve on many levels when it comes to health, emotional well-being, relationships, or ability to receive money, forgiveness will unlock this for me. And so it is. Go ahead and grab your wrist and pulse around. Breathe in. Breathe out. And say peace. Brilliant. Excellent, excellent job. Thank you so much for talking with me, guys. I know you're already feeling better. Go share. Whom are you forgiving? What is your big why? I'm very excited to read your responses. If you have any questions, of course, do ask. We are doing Facebook Live every day, Monday through Friday. So I'll send more information in the email. So keep your eye on it. And so this way I'll get a chance to interact and ask some questions from me directly if you need a little bit more support. But honestly, enjoy the journey. You worth it. You deserve it. It is for you. It's your time. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.